What's up, party people? Dandy B and H Guy. Today's Saturday. It's 11.30 in the morning. I just got back from the Goodwill Hudson, New Hampshire, guys. Um, I spent $58, and that was after 20% off and a $5 coupon. And uh, I found some really good stuff today, guys. Really good stuff <clears throat> for 58 bucks. So, um, first up, I have a couple hard goods. I get this coffee mug. Um, this is by Lockheed, Lockheed Martin Electronics. Um, this is about the 1997 Ethics Awareness. So this is a vintage Lockheed Martin coffee mug. And um, Lockheed Martin coffee mugs sell for pretty good prices, guys. So I'm gonna try to get at least $24.99 for this to start. So I picked that up. Um, I know I got another mug in here somewhere. I got another mug right here. This is a glass, uh, New Hampshire Vocational Technical College, guys. And I think they changed the name of this place. And um, so this might be vintage, guys. And there's nothing like this on eBay. There's other things by this college. But uh, like I said, I'm going to keep an eye open for college mugs and um, glasses. And hoping to get about 25 bucks for this, guys. So I picked that up. <clears throat> I, uh, I found this, I've never even seen this before guys, this is a Japanese hot water bottle and I'm not sure what you do with it, but it's new sealed and these sell for um, 30, 35 bucks guys, so it was less than $4, so I picked it up, I'll have to do a, watch a YouTube video on how to use that thing, I have no idea. Um, picked up a couple rackets, guys, and these are um, for racquetball. And um, these are by E Force, and both are di uh, both are a little bit different, but um, they're both in pretty decent shape, guys. There's one of them that's got some cracks on the handle, but um, I looked these up, guys, and these are selling for um, at least thirty to sixty bucks. Um, so I'm gonna do some research on these guys, and um, these should be really easy to ship. But they're less than four dollars a piece, guys. So uh, yeah, I pulled the trigger on these. All right, guys. So I got some clothing in here. Uh, first up is a Nike Dry Fit Golf Men's um, the YMCA polo shirt, and this is embroidered on the side. Um, it says pre-core. I'm not sure what pre-core is, guys, but I bought it because of the uh, YMCA and it's a Nike Dry Fit. And I think I got to give this a quick wash. But um, yeah, I picked that up. Hopefully, 25 bucks for that, guys. Uh, next up is a um, pretty decent brand to look for. This is a uh, G Gear for sports. And this is a men's quarter zip pullover. Uh, Foxwoods Casino men's sweatshirt pullover quarter zip jacket size large and um, yeah hopefully this sells someday it's by a decent brand a lot of people like Foxwoods so uh, yeah I pulled the trigger on this guys next up I had to uh, look this up this is called Stomp in Paradise the major res wrestling figure podcast and um there's a few things for sale on ebay by this by this podcast guys and uh but i don't think there's any t-shirts so i found this t-shirt by the podcast it doesn't even have there's no writing on the inside there's no labels um so uh yeah guys i'm gonna try to get at least 40 bucks for this probably put this on auction guys This right here is not a great brand, but I bought it for the subject. This is the Outer Banks men's polo shirt, but it says United States Power Squadrons Vessel Ex uh, Examiner. So I'm not sure if that's like a, uh, a sub, a sub, a submarine or something like that, but I'm going to look this up. It's military. Um, so that's why I picked it up, guys. Embroidered shirt. And is that a spot? Might have a tiny little spot on the back, 
But, uh, yeah, guys. Something embroidered like that. Hopefully, it's going to be the only one on eBay. And hopefully, it sells someday, too. That'd be good. Next up is a uh, t-shirt, guys. This is vintage single stitch on a Hanes heavyweight tag. And this is called Bitter Root Ranch, Du Bois, Wyoming. I think that's how you say it. But um, yeah, this is single stitch, guys. It's a ranch, old school t-shirt, probably from the 90s, guys. And um, hopefully somebody wants to buy this from me. Next on deck is a Nike Dry Fit men's medium t-shirt. And this is a baseball t-shirt, guys. So it's got the baseball graphic. It's got the baseball logo on the bottom corner. Hopefully get about 23, 24 bucks for this at least. This shirt I might keep myself. Um, this is a Nike Dry Fit. Long sleeve men's t-shirt, size three extra large. And um, I might try this on, guys. If it fits me good, I'm going to keep it. If it's a little too big, I'll sell it. But um, yeah, Nike Dry Fit. This here is a pretty cool shirt. There's only one other on eBay. This is a, uh, a Guinness Beer Men's button-down short sleeve shirt, guys. And, um, you know, probably going to be nothing crazy on this. Hope, hopefully, about like, well, 25 bucks. Guinness beer, men's shirt. And it's got the official label, guys. Size extra large. So, hopefully, about 25 bucks of this. A couple more things on deck. This right here, guys, I think this is going to be worth some money. Um... This is, I think, from the Office TV show on a canvas tag, Dunder Mifflin Incorporated, Paper Company, Picnic 09, Nashua, New Hampshire, guys. And I'm pretty sure this is from the uh, show. I didn't watch the show, but um, I'm going to do some more research on this and see if there's anything like this on uh, eBay. I'm probably going to research it right after this video, guys. And um, I'm going to shoot for the stars for this, guys. So hopefully... Uh, on a good day, hopefully 40 bucks for this. So we'll see. And last up is the first time that I found this brand, but I looked it up and there's some decent prices. Um, this is a men's Hawaiian shirt by Caribbean Silk Blend. And this has got like a toucan parrot bird theme, guys. And I believe this is vintage and... Um, Hopefully you get about 25 to 30 bucks to this, guys. So, uh, yeah, that's what I found today. Um, you know, I've got some time off from work to uh, heal my hernia. So just staying active and, um, yeah, trying to find some clothing while I heal up, guys. So that's about it for today. As always, guys, thanks for watching. We'll, uh, we'll talk soon. Peace out, guys. Later.